All right, guys, I'm back with another unboxing. I was actually supposed to make this one like two weeks ago, but for some reason this box got rejected by UPS and got sent back. So it went all the way back to California, and obviously they didn't want to just cover shipping again to send it all the way back to me, so I had to order more stuff, so it was like an order and a half. And I basically I paid way too much for this box to get here, and I don't remember exactly what's in it because it's been so long. I do know that it's from Surplus, so it's going to have Mystery and Life Extension and maybe some FSC. Um, I don't really have a clue, to be honest with you. I could look at the packing slip, but that's cheating. I like to be surprised because this is, that, this is the only way to make unboxing videos enjoyable for me is if I actually legitimately try to forget what's in the order so that when I open it up, I'm surprised too. Uh, one of the other weird things about Surplus is that it's not really weird, but it's something that a lot of people probably don't know because you don't make orders for skate shops. Uh, but they send you like this spreadsheet and it's got a whole list of everything that they've got in their inventory, but there's not a picture for everything. So sometimes you're ordering stuff really just based off of the brand and the name. And it's a little bit nerve wracking because you never know if you're gonna be able to sell that stuff or not because you don't know what it looks like. But anyway, I'm talking too much and opening up not enough. Small front graphic, big back graphic. That dead feather stuff is so sick. I'm gonna keep going on the t-shirts even though I've got some other stuff kind of in the way. I knew I got a bunch of acid stuff. I know I got a pocket teeth though. Oh wow, okay that one's cool. This one's cool too, but you've already seen this one. It's just another one of these. This is fucking sick. Wow, why did I get that in extra large? Wow. That's gnarly. All right, cool. interesting I'm not exactly sure what's up with that but this is a life extension I love cheeks shirt with an element tag on it inside tag life extension somebody explain that to me because that kind of weird shit gets me every time and I don't I don't get it same thing cool shirt they actually just posted this one on Instagram this morning I'm tearing some of these open and I don't have to <laughs> because the bags are actually already open at the top. I'm an amateur. I also let them talk me into getting a couple of these and they're actually pretty big. I forget what the retail is on them. It does kind of smell like bananas. This is probably really insanely boring for you guys, but I had to know. That's how much wax is in there. Now you guys know too. All right. Paper, cool. Hell yeah. Dead feather snapback. Ooh, I've been waiting for that one. That is so sick. All right. Wow. 
Mystery decal. More mystery decals. More mystery decals. More mystery decals. Whole bunch of thieves stickers. Mystery decal. Mystery decal. Reflective acid American flag stickers. Acid patch. Mystery patches. More stickers. More stickers. Back to the bearings. Paper. Hell yeah. Boom. All right, and that's it for this one. I've actually got customers beating on the door already, harassing me trying to get in here. So I should probably price this stuff and get it out. Um, oh, I want to show you guys one more thing. One of the other local businesses dropped this off the other day. It's an old Veriflex board. This is actually his business here, the Agapagos Toy and Pop Culture Museum, I think. Toy and Pop, yeah. It's pretty cool. It costs like two bucks to go look at a bunch of old toys. And uh, he dropped this off to me for marketing purposes. There's a ton of cool old stickers on there. And uh, I figured I'd throw it up on here so you guys could see it. It is on my Instagram as well if you want to see a better picture of it. But whatever. You probably don't care about it. I'm rambling. The customers want in. I got to get this stuff out. This hat is sick. This one's pretty fucking tight too. I got to go.